the shower area in Joe's house is typical for early 23rd century Malay Peninsula homes. A generous space with non-slip floors, brightly colored walls that change its hue based on the time of day, and an AI-controlled liquid-based cleanser unit which is totally self-sufficient with water reclamation capability. The nozzle that discharges the cleaning liquid is based on the severity of uncleanliness of the user. These are detected by sensors that line all the entrances of the house. Before James, the information would be channeled through numerous organo holo emitters throughout the house. But with James, it's tidier as he manages the dissemination of the output. Joe, I have laid out your pajamas on the bed. If you need me to dress you, please let me know. Joe shot a long angry stare at this drone that was outside the shower unit. Not only has this thing invaded his privacy, now he wants to treat him like a baby. His indignation begins to bubble to the surface. But his mum, ever the consummate just-in-time expert, announces, James, let him wear his own clothes. He's old enough to do that himself. Come, help me prepare dinner. Dinner in a village is often an occasion when the entire family sits and customs are observed. It is no different in Joe's household. Matriarchal culture and practices are the norm here. Women in the household enjoy virtual control over all and sundry in the family unit. Steamed rice cooked to perfection. The village delicacies heavy with spices and herbs. Cooked, steamed, fried and boiled. Poultry, fish and the occasional venison. These are, however, grown in the backyard of the house. The discovery of growing organic matter and inserting choice DNA has all but eliminated the need to slaughter reared animals. The barbaric practice of animal butchery ended with the commercialization of organoprotein meats by the Australasian co-op from Perth back in the late 21st century. Joe, you know that you will soon be sitting through your ability match session. I need you to prepare yourself for it and James will help you through it. Joe busily munching away his dinner nods in agreement. He has been preparing himself for this day since he can remember. Preparing for the session means mental focus exercises, aptitude related tests and forms of physical regime best suited for Joe based on his preliminary results. And how is James supposed to help me? He mutters while continuing munching through what's left of his dinner. Ma, Bapa is on Bitcoin. I will put the call to the bedroom. Thank you, James. Joe, finish up and help James with cleaning up. Joe sighs. He was looking forward for a round of holo games with his friends. Another early night, I guess. Bedtime is usually fairly straightforward. But for Joe, his routine is interrupted by the presence of James, this uninvited guest in his domain. His thoughts are mired in anger and directed at his mother. How could she? Before long, Joe begins to slip into his slumber and all is quiet in the household, safe for the conversation his parents are having next door. Bright and early, need to plan out my activities today, best to get the guys together. Philip's makan day is today, I can't wait, best to sneak up before that thing sees me. Joe quietly slips into the bathroom to wash. Before long, he was ready and about to leave when James stops him. Are you meeting your friends this morning? Joe, unhappy with this surprise, elects to just nod. I understand that you'll be at Philip's house today. If you are, I highly recommend that you be extra vigilant in the presence of those agri dones. They are quite aggressive. Also, Ma will be meeting Bapa today in Moa. So there will only be the two of us tonight. Joe stops to absorb this latest information feed from James and concludes how happy he will be tonight without Mark. I will be alone. Well, not exactly, but alone. Hooray! He thinks to himself and quietly smirks. Yes, James, I'll be careful and say bye to Mark. I'll be back after lunch. Bye.